Well, that was a crazy spawn all of a sudden. Anyways, welcome back to Halo Infinite. We left off last part. Uh, what did we do last part? I think we kind of... Well, not really finished exploring a certain area, but... Looking back on it now... Still a lot left to do, so I think that's how we left off. So we're actually gonna try to finish this side, like, for real this time. As soon as I can, so we can start on the actual... Get, like, the last couple of bacons. So, we're gonna do that today. And starting today... Ik Novus, the Devourer. I have an act chieftain. One of the more experienced members of the Banished, Ik Novus was part of the Covenant attack on Jericho 7 that decimated several human cities with unyielding force. Serving under the brute chieftain known as the Thrall Slayer, Ik Novus soon became renowned for his violent and bloodthirsty nature, including a particular penchant for eating the severed limbs of his opponents while they watched on in agony. Oh. Barring the title Iknovus Devourer, throughout his own meteoric rise to chieftain, the Jilahane warrior continued to lay waste to human settlements even after breaking away from the Covenant. Pack Warrior's Wrath joined the Banish in 2550 and began to indiscriminately target any species or factions stood in their wing. He has a volatile skewer, fourth lance first combat element, warrior. So the Banish already existed by... Huh, interesting. Right, so we're actually gonna have to prepare for this guy. So I know exactly point, what sir. we're gonna use. I know I know this is like OP as heck, but I mean move, the guy is a chieftain with a giant skewer, like Yeah, you know, stuff like this is gonna happen. Okay, right off the bat a collectible. That's right. Yeah, I wonder how much more she'll be able to take me for. Hey, that was too close. Holy crap. How did they get set up so quick? They came with a purpose and a plan, Spark. Blue Bell Squad. That much is clear. Taurus leader to Victor 321, requesting a change to the LZ. Alright, take him out, boys. Set us down by that banished artillery. We're taking him out. Oh, crap! Rockets! the UNSC further lost today. Oh, I didn't know you could take those out. Oh, sweet. Good to see you, Chief. Yeah, it's up. <laughs> All right. Shotgun. Second day gun offline, Griff. Good work, Taurus. Let's move on that far gun. Give Infinity's birds some breathing room up there. What is that? It's coming from that tower to the north. It's... Taurus! Sipra! Now! We dream, sir. But everything except for my armor is down. Must have been that blast. That last AA gun is down too. Whatever that was, it leveled the playing field. Let's go! We got work to do! That's what I like to see. Kick him off. Disembarking. What's that? Need more data to reconstruct the, heck the floor was this? sequence. Let's find the remaining beacons. Some sort of like fighting arena? I think these guys are crazy. We got the chief. That's right. Here 
here, boys. More banished incoming. Take them out too. Shoot it down again. There we go. Oh crap! I think that's like parts of the the thing, the uh what do you call it? Oh watch out Marines! I think that's part of the uh the phantom that I shot down. It's all glitched. Am I looking? What? Uh. What the fuck? Yeah. My. What the heck was that? It killed my Marines. It was like a a miniature remote controlled phantom of some kind. What? Wow. I see how it is. Oh, crap. I'm good. I made it. Ow. about that grunt. Good. Nice. I didn't even know these guys were out here. All hostiles eliminated. Ooh. I think we're clear. They fought well, don't you think? Yeah, actually, they kind of did. This is a pretty big outpost. Or like area with a lot of banished. Pretty long. <sighs> Spartan Makovich, the ring is coming apart beneath your feet. Recommend one crisis at a time, please. Oh, I'm at a sniper round. Right, that's bad. 
Spartan Makovich, your sidearm is insufficient to deal with sentinels in such numbers. Recommend... Yeah, retreat. I'm working on it. Spartan Makovich, your current speed of 47 kph is... One more physics lesson and I'm ripping you out of my head. What was he going on about a giant gun? What's that supposed to mean? We're in range of Ignovus the Devourer, so named because, well, he's a brute, so you can probably guess. <laughs> Dangerous doesn't begin to describe this guy. Don't turn your back on him. That, that's, that looks pretty bad. All right. Let's do exactly not that and go right to his face. I need, I need to disrupt the pistol. Again, this Give me that <laughs> on the target. Let's clean up the rest of them. Mine now. Clear. Wait, nope. Oh. Where? All right, let's see what this is. Wall little skewer. The devourer is no more. And if his dossier is accurate, that's a very, very good thing. I'm grossed out just thinking about it. <laughs> so I'm gonna stop thinking about it. Great work, Chief. It's not Cortana, you do exactly that. Log. What more do you want with me? Humans are so easy to break. Chandra. Their flesh is soft. Their minds fragile. You have served Asherim well. What? What was that thing? My kind would once have called it divine. And now? An opportunity. On your feet, human. We need to know what else is in that little head of yours. Take him to my tower. Dude, something weird is going on here. I mean, that's that's saying a lot. Like, you know, the ring that will decimate the galaxy. That's weird enough. But, like, there's some, like... Real shady looking stuff going on. Stuff I don't like. Is what I identify as. That fob belongs to the banished. It should belong to us. Oh, there's like three of them. Four of them. 
It explodes when it hits targets. Hey, look, I got one like that too. <laughs> but mine explodes, dude. I think that's all of them. Fob Bravo is ready for liberation. Liberation. All right. The UNSC suffered through a lot on this ring, but thanks to you, they have a chance at survival. Oh, great! <laughs> Here we go. Two targets. Still have some beacons left to find Bunch before the forerunner sequence is complete. Which one's next? No idea right now, Cortana. Not Cortana. Coming in clear. That's exactly what we're gonna do. Okay, so we'll go to the Jest Squad. Then we'll take the Horn of Aboli. Oh, that's the thing that they were talking about. You know what? We'll take the Horn of Abolition at the end. I have an idea. Oh, hello. That one didn't even notice. We'll <laughs> never expect it. Enforcements inbound. Enforcements, you say? Oh, it's gone. All banished forces nice. eliminated. The squad made it. That burb just mad dogging me. He's mad bourbon me. <laughs> nice. The UNSC lost so many on this ring, but now that you're back, they've got a fighting chance at survival. Mm. E. Bip bap. The mercenary Bipap is among the most dangerous Ungoys known to the UNSC. Once a bodyguard for high-ranking Covenant officials, Bipap earned his reputation for ruthlessness in service of the Chieftain Tartarus. He served under Tartarus? Oh. Playing scores of his own people for siding with the elites in the Great War. Following the collapse of the Covenant, Bipap returned to his homeworld of Barajo to refashion himself as an assassin for hire. He was so successful that he was granted the title of Vanquisher by his clan. Bipap is notorious for numerous acts of widespread destruction on the colony of Venzia. For his rest relentlessness and ruthless pursuit of his targets and the collateral damage caused along the way resulted in over 830 human casualties. Seen Disruptor. Alpha Pack 9th Combat Element, Heart of Tull. We will deal with him with extreme, very extreme prejudice. Nothing against grunts, but... you kill 800-something people like that. That's my job. You're taking work from me. You know, you don't do that. Mm. If it wasn't clear yet how bafflingly doomed you all are, it sure will be soon. Our control of this ring is absolute and getting absoluter every hour. We're in range of Bip Bap the Vanquisher, one of the UNSC's most wanted, if you can believe it. Let's see how he fares against a Spartan. Probably not very well, considering the guy is three feet tall. You're amazing. There he is. Where is he? Oh, he survived that. 
And he's dead. <laughs> Target down. Let's deal with the leftovers. Oh wow, they hit with their shields. That's cool. They're all armed with shock weapons. That's a wrap on Bitbat. I think you just killed the universe's deadliest grunt. Yeah, probably that's did. One less hassle for the UNSC on this. He's run. less deadly than Yap Yap. How can you be less deadly than? Still yep? have some beacons more left to find than before yep. the forerunner sequence is complete. Which one? Yep, yep is literally the destroyer. What the heck, dude? Yeah, you call me a coward. Wow, this thing's really good. Coincidence that the banish beat us here. We're not prepared. Quiet. Where's that sound coming from? That structure to the north. You see in that light? Everybody down now. That's the horn of Apple. What's going on? It's the target. It's her. In Anna or oh, right. UNSC distress signal detected. More Marines in need of backup. Hey, huh? will live to fight another day. I hope we see them back at the fobs. Pretty secure. I only see one. See what makes this guy so deadly. Av Sebarine Kaidan. First lance, third combat element. Warriors of Alas. Aidan Thav Sebarim was one of the leading Covenant commanders in their final strikes against Earth and its colonies on Reach and Luna. Oh, okay. He abandoned his station after the Prophets betrayed the elites and fled back to his homeworld of Suvan to be reunited with their kin at the Keep of Malastan. As the Sangheili people descended into a vicious cycle of civil war, the Kaidan joined forces with Atria. As the Banished did not discriminate against Sangheili warriors, so long as they were skilled. Sebarim has become infamous for his actions in the Battle of Harrow, where his siege to the city of Adravan resulted in the deaths of over 700,000 human civilians. Arcane Sentinel Beam. Oh, I really want to deal with this guy myself now. We're closing in on Sav Sebarim, high-ranking Banish target. He's got a lot of blood on his hands. Time for some payback. Yep. Got a ghost. Get 
Oh, that wasn't that hard. <laughs> This thing runs out of energy fast. Like I had heard about, about this thing, but like, uh, but I didn't know it was this. Severine's death won't bring back all the civilians he killed, but he'll never take another human life again. He got what he deserved. <laughs> Good work, Chief. Right. Rings. We are reclaiming this ring. One kill at a time. Razor back in. I want to move. Hold tight, Chief. I want to move. Ring, you're good. Might want to move. Ring, you might want to move. I can't even laugh at that. Master Chief. Me? Give me something. On foot. Wait, seriously? For me? Yes, for you, Marine. Don't make me regret this. All right, Marines. We have a job to do. I present to you, Laser Squad. <laughs> yeah, I'm not very original with these names. I can't really think of it on the fly right now. I don't know about the rest of you, but I'm kind of having fun. <laughs> yeah, this is pretty fun, actually. All right, we're going to blind the enemy with these Watch lasers. It's going to be like a uh, cold play concert. We're approaching the comm station we detected. The Horn of Abolition. Fire! It's blasting out tons of signals. Oh. Including decrypted you. Uh -oh. Lock this in. I would say that's bad, but oh my! They're not letting this facility go without a fight. All the more reason to take that array apart. Let's get the lockdown lifted. Oh crap! Jeez, dude, we're melting everybody. Oh, they'll kill me if it falls. No. Yeah, now you're performing a laser show on Zeta Halo. Is that all of them for now? One more in front. Jeez, dude. That was, uh, wow. I have no words. Where, 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 where? Dang. Dang, this thing just melts enemies. Is that the horn? That thing's so small. How do we get in there? I, I always have trouble with these little doors. That was just me tapping the fire button. I didn't even hold it. I just gently tapped it. Got him. How do you log down here? I'm not gonna say I found a new favorite, but <laughs> it's pretty deadly. Data we scrapped together, the banished outpost Horn of Abolition. And these guys have a flair for the dramatic. Seems uniquely positioned as the center of their activity on this side of the ring. Judging by the sensor array they've built here, it's no wonder that they've been a step ahead of every move we've tried to make since the reverie fell. 
This is how they're rounding us up. They're setting up infrastructure. The array, the comm towers. Ashram's got eyes everywhere. Oh, I'm dumb. This one is actually open on top. Hard light ammo. Lock it. Secure the area. That's good, I saw the ripples there. Another log. That was that secure as I saw it. Ah, for the turret. Are exposed. Now we just have to. Not good. Banished reinforcements inbound, Chief. I got it. I got it. I got it. It's working. Three more to go. I would too. I was small and very fragile. What else? Surviving UNSC personnel in this ring a little safer. There are still scanning towers in operation around the ring, but they'll be less effective without the nerve center. Good work. Whew. Okay, horn of abolition. Done for. So are my those are my laser show squad. Dang it. We'll need more data to reconstruct. We were a little too sequence. powerful. Let's find the remaining beacons. Yeah. Now let's find the remaining bacons, but I guess we're gonna have to do that next time. Okay. Hey, okay, a rat, a rat, a rat. 
Well, we kind of did something. At least we destroyed the Horn of Abolition. That's like a really big thing. So we'll continue Jeez. next time. Uh, so for now, thank you for watching. You're all fantastic. And I'll see you next episode.